Right. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Lads, ladies, players, players, real people behind the profile stats. You want to fight, you want a big fight, yeah, alright. Time point, I'm making my smile point, F by F, into a game plan, check my, 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 one, two, one, two, check. Right, you want to have a fight, yeah? You want the biggest fight. You want to get on with it, yeah? You want to face the music, yeah? You want to put in the dancing shoes, yeah? Alright, I'm going to call my mate, Borean. We're going to just, we're going to put our dancing shoes on and deal with it, bruv. Yeah, who wants to have a big issue? Come, let's go. Basically, this is how it works, right? Don't become a little chicken, yeah? You know what I'm saying? Let's get on with it. Come, it's a fighting game, yeah? You know it's a fighting game. You know it's got guns in their hands, yeah? Heavy guns. They even raise the troops back up again. Yeah, it's a fighting game. Yeah? So don't make it like as if, like, oh, got too much eyeliner on, got too much lip shadow gloss and mascara. It doesn't matter what size quiff you got. It doesn't matter what size pa Yeah, it's not about pants management. It's not about socks management. It's about dealing with it and getting on with it management, bruv. Yeah? That's what we're playing. That's what we're doing. That's how we're doing it. We're not product of abandoning ship. You know what I'm saying? Our ancestors never did it. Yeah? Unless your ancestors did it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so it's not about jumping on a pogo stick with your lollipop on that. It's not about having pink no, no polish on. It's about dealing with it. Dealing with your issues and getting on with it. Getting on with it and getting up with it, bruv. Yeah, so we're making it happen for a dose that be worthy. I'm going to have a big issue with you. You know why? Because we're going to learn to agree to just purely disagree. We want discord, you know what I'm saying? Discord means not getting on with each other, you know what I'm saying? Don't get on with each other. So how we do it is, look, you can ask me which is the best Legendary Pirates. And I will tell you, Black Bart, Sadi, Annabelle, Ching Shi. But then there's the mid range ones as well. They're like Caesar, Greenbeard. Do you understand what I'm saying? That's where you put those lazy pirates, and the rest will just be below. Because there are. Lady pirates to have certain specific outfits too, you see. I consider the outfits too. The thing is, when you ask which is the best lady pirate, the thing is, you can't answer that question entirely honestly because there's outfits. The, the, the thing is, when you when you talk about a lady pirate, you can't talk about a lady pirate without having clothes on. Do you understand what I'm saying? Unless you put them in the normal natural clothes that they come in. Yeah, the first clothes, the outfit that they come with. But everything else ultimately gives buffs. And the thing is, this game can only be best played by using those buffs that benefit your troops the most. Because even the game that I'm playing I don't need to deploy the legendary pirate. Do you understand what I'm talking about? I don't have to deploy the legendary pirate that I'm using. I don't have to. Because I'm using the outfit even when I don't deploy the troops. So that's how I look at it. It's like saying, oh, why do you have to go into battle with guild ship troops, yeah? That that issue never ends with some people, some players. It never ever ends. And the thing is, that I could question you, why do you use perks? Why do you use lazy pirates? You might as well go sit on your own outside of a guild if you don't want to ask for guild chip troops. So what are you doing? It's benefiting from perks then. So the thing is, if you've already grown so strong, only because you've already stood up on your own two feet, why don't you help support others? And that's the thing, you know, I'm not saying I'm right and you're wrong. To prove myself right, I don't have to prove you wrong. You have to learn to discuss certain points and things. That's what you call constructive criticism. And when you do not discuss things, and you want it to be like a one-way thing, remember, this is a fighting game. So I'm going to put purely battles of destroying players and people that I feel like whipping, you understand? I'm not here to make friends. 
I'm here to make family, to give more than I take. That's how I feel. But only to the ones that be worthy. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, that's the side of the town that I am raised from. That's where I'm from. That's how we do things this side of town. We don't just allow, you know, the amber herds to come in and just like try to just manipulate use like certain ways of manipulation of private messaging and and then they become they, they try to win your trust and we don't need that bro we've been past that you understand what i'm saying when you find out what people have really been through in their lives this game is nothing compared to what people have gone through in real life you can't compare the two you can't Yeah, people have been through difficult times, very challenging times. So this game cannot compare with the difficulties that people have been through. So don't try to impose your ways of manipulation. Yeah, we want to have a fight. So it's like I work towards the outfits because I realized that it's the percentages. Yeah. It's the percentages that ultimately will make the bigger difference ultimately the percentages is what the game is all about so when you ask which is the best lady pirate i will tell you annabelle and hopefully you won't ask why you like you'll realize a year later why because Annabelle is the best at the Thunderstruck event. Then you would ask me which is the best Lady Pirate. This time I want to tell you it's Jean DeBerry. You'd be like, last time you said it was Annabelle. Why do you say it's Jean DeBerry this time? I'm going to tell you that I just realized that Jean DeBerry, if your Lady Pirate fort like this is centralized to the island in the middle somewhere, Anything that's close to it, it gives the highest percentage of a number, 55, which no Legendary Pirate has on a defense. Then after you'd be asking me, which is the best Legendary Pirate? Because, you know, you forgot, like, you know, like, you got a lot going on. Then I'll tell you, it's Sadie. You'd be like, oh, but I just remembered. Last time you said it was Annabelle. Then you said it was Gene DeBerry. And now you're saying it's Sadie. What are you going on about, bruv? I'll be like, you know what? Every upgrade and training that I've done on my entire island and of the Lazy Pirates raising 20, 12, 13, 14 million drugs per day. I did it with Sadie. Every day I played with her. And you're going to come back again to me another time. You're going to say to me, which is the best Lazy Pirate? And this time I'll say to you, I won't be saying to you that it's Annabelle. I won't be saying to you that he's Gene DeBerry. I won't be saying to you that he's Moses. That he's uh, Sadie. Sadie. I'll be saying to you he's Black Bart. You'd be like, why do you say he's Black Bart? Because once you said to me that the best lady pirate was Annabelle. Then you said it was Gene DeBerry. Then you said it was Sadie. But why are you saying he's Black Bart now? And I'll tell you, you know what? I figured from your little one. It wasn't even me. He told me. It goes to me that the black bar is the best one. And the reality was and is that defensively and in the attacks and taking on against the ground pounder range, firing range, the only legendary pirate that can withstand the firing range of the ground pounder and cause a distraction is black bar. That one right there, that fluffy Christmas beard, fluffy buck nugget. Ha <laughs> ha! That one right there. That's the best laser pirate in, throughout in the entire game. Why do you think they're trying to sell it to you? Why do you think why do you think they got me trying to like promote this game? You understand what I'm saying? Like I'm I'm the spokesperson. Yeah, I'm the spokesperson for from the pirates. But you know what it is? I don't want it. I don't want it. It's not for me. I'm here for the loyal players. I'm only here, I'm loyal to the people, you understand what I'm saying? You don't want people like me to become leaders, you understand what I'm saying? I'll rather be I'm a I'm a I'm a team player. Yeah, I'm like that. I'm like a fish eating vegetarian. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to get involved. 
the crusher yes yeah the crusher that's the one number one red flag fleet you don't have to even be part of your team or even be there to be part of your progress you understand what i'm saying this is how we do things you know what i'm saying yeah i want to have a big fight yeah let's have a big fight let's go yeah i'm up for it yeah look I know who my friends are now, I know who my family is, you understand what I'm saying? That's how we're doing it. When you see anyone's PRs jumping up and down, guilds, wherever they are, whatever is happening, you know that the unique rebels playing Rubik's Cube. Yeah. Some were playing hide and seek before. Some even right now playing snakes and ladders. Captain <laughs> Colton P. I mentioned you earlier on, Sunshines. This player is not even in the guild. I'm gonna keep his PR up above the thousand. That's where that's where he belongs, you know what I'm saying? He doesn't have to even be part of a girl. I'm telling you, it's too much headache. Captain Colton P, believe me. Trust me. I when I first started this game, I was not in a guild. I had upgrades going and I was like doing a lot of progress. You see what I'm saying? So Captain Colton P, you're a legend already, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's like I don't know, I'd like to see like how your outfits have done and whatever, but at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter anyway. It's, this game, if you want this game to last you 10 years, you can. If you want this game to last you, there's no way, it doesn't matter how much gems you have. Even if there was an event like Infinite, just why have you upgraded upgrades, why have you trained trains? But even then the outfits, you understand what I'm saying? Like you have to do battles to get those outfits or whatever events. If the events for back to back. I've got too many ideas. The thing is, I'm not the type of person. Do you know what? I'm kind of glad. I, You know what? There's so many things i like to say and I would like to just... Yeah, it's either to be or not to be and I guess it's not to be. So I'm not going to go into the realms of saying anything really. I feel as if sometimes the poetry of silence speaks volumes. You allow your gameplay to do the talking. This is hunting <clears throat> they were champions. This is KKXX KKXX KK Fire Lightning Gadabadoof Patashed. This player went one on one head to head with Lamar Yu. Yeah, this is a top player legend, I'm telling you, strong player. Never ever disrespect or underestimate this player. Serious. Yeah, I mean, I have that level of respect, you know, understanding towards players. 
that have really been able to achieve certain specifics throughout the game. I have to have that bit of understanding towards what they have achieved and what they were able to do. This is the first player that scored over 500k. This is the one. This is the one. Do you understand? This player is the one that scored over 550k. Now let me say that again. Lamar Yu was the first player to score over 500k. This was the first player to go over 550k. That's the facts. No one scored those high points until Lamar Yu was the first one. To score 500k, this player went over 550. I remember that clearly. I remember rivalries. I remember who goes against who. I remember when I faced Jackie the first time. You understand what I'm saying? This player faced Lamar Yu. I'm telling you, that's what I know this. Yeah, hunting leaderboard champions. Yeah, this is a fantastic game. It's down to the players to make what they want of it. All you have to do is continue playing. As long as you're playing, as long as you're active. But to give up on your guild and go to another guild and rest it and still be active I mean you know it's important to always do what you feel is right for yourselves and that's the main thing you don't have to be pressurized you don't have to try to play a hero and then upset yourself even more this game is not worth being upset over it's just worth playing and just enjoying don't let it get to you because that's what it does it's like when Xavier Said to the Phoenix, don't let it control you. Do you understand what I'm saying? Don't let them control you. If you hear my voice, echo, 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 echo. Be assured, I died. Always be there for you. And all those, those, those. That'd be where you could ever do for toast. Is it gonna be used? Yes. Oh my word. <laughs> yeah, as I said, don't let it control you. You see? This is what this game does. Yeah, this is what the game does. Yeah, because then you start feeling, you start understanding. Yeah, look what he's done now, yeah? I'd rather, yeah? I'd rather find pugs. I'd rather find pugs and say hello. And I know that pugs is probably with whoever's and wherever's and whatever's. But at the end of the day, this is what I'd rather do. I'd rather drop some PR to friends and family people that I enjoy playing with and against and around. Look, even though Smithy is where like at uh, Rocky Outcrops, and I understand exactly why, you understand, you can't have a QM of your caliber. I, I understand, I end exactly understand you, Smithy. So, <laughs> bruv, you don't need it, I know that. 
I know, I know. Yeah, it's so good. You're carrying things what you're doing, man. You're all right. You've got your little ones. you got the game. This game is too connected. It's too serious. This game can bring a different side out of people and it can bring a a different type of an approach. And this game is... Yeah, I think uh, it's time to put everyone off. Everyone, stop, unsubscribe to my channel. Yeah, it's time to just roll back. It's time to go back into the shadows that we came out from. You know what I'm saying? It's time to... Uh, allow the nature to take its course. Yeah, I want to have a fight with everyone. You know what I'm saying? You see me island, you attack me, bruv. I don't want to give up mushrooms. I'm going to be breaking shield every day, all day. I don't even care, you know what I'm saying? I'm not here to make friends. <laughs> I'm here to make family. I'm here to make things happen. Yeah, allow me to go. Baby boom. Baby boom. What's that, PH14? Yeah, let's hit baby boom. I told you I was going to come for your family and everyone. Yeah, it's a game, man. Just enjoy it. Don't get all serious in that, bruv. It's not like as if I'm part of your household and family that you feel like as if you could chat monkeys to me. Someone by the name of Julian came onto the Discord and, uh, and this one here, Speedy Gonzalez, start asking... Are you that Julian, the one that done the maximum? Like as if that Julian's gonna come to make friends on a stupid Discord of Planet Pirates. You idiot. Like as if someone's in a, a Chinese brother sister's gonna come and join a stupid Discord group of people that just wanna hate people. Like as if that's gonna ever happen, bruv. You must be more delusional than the word delusional itself. I'm telling you, you're totally cracked in the head. Yeah, I don't care about one stars and two stars and three stars. All I care about is I'm smacking your people, you know what I'm saying? I don't care. Like, because I give them monkeys or mushrooms. Like as if I'm going to win a trophy or something. I can't give a monkey, you know what I'm saying? That's all, just going to smack him one. I don't care about baby boom. This is a fighting game. We've got babies sticking their heads and nose and nappies and diapers and dappers and crappers into here and that. Yeah. Yeah, that's how we're doing it. That's how we're playing it. I told you, in it? This game. <laughs> <coughs> This game really has a lot of potential. Allow me to go as I continue to lay a smackdown on these mushroom monkey, mushroom babies. Yeah. It's not my fault. Midoki gave birth to such... Anyways, that's the one. Potashed. <laughs>